Um, well, can you imagine trying to start your business and then suddenly a global pandemic hits? Aaron Fields talked with two local startups to see what it's been like. So I've been here since February 1st, um, and then the virus hit. So great time to open your own business. <laughs> Scotty Muse moved to Bismarck from Atlanta in 2013. After working other jobs, he decided to open up his own massage studio called The Nook this year which was supposed to be an exciting time for him. I felt like it was starting to do this, of course, you know, because more and more people were finding out. As it is with any new business, Muse was still in the process of getting his name out there. But then the coronavirus hit, and business dropped. I mean, honestly, I've filed for unemployment, and I was approved, so, I mean, that's definitely going to help. Hasn't been easy, but... It's not really in our control, I guess. It's not the only business that's had problems either. Amici Pizza is in the process of opening up right now, and the owners are trying to turn the negative into something positive. Little did we know at the time that it was kind of a blessing in disguise because we weren't fully staffed and operational and having to lay off a whole crew of people uh, when all of the restrictions were put in place. Even during these hard times, both Cerdes and Muse tell me the community support has made it a little bit easier. I've had people reach out to buy gift cards um, and then even right before like we got shut down and we had to cease operations. Like I had people pay for their appointments that obviously had to be canceled. We have opportunities here that no other place in the world has. And I think if, as long as we all keep that in mind and keep a positive attitude, we're going to get through this and come out the other side. It might be a little slower for a while, but eventually we'll get back to where we were and even better. Reporting in Bismarck for Cakes News, I'm Aaron Fields. The state's cease operation policy is still in effect until April, or April 20th for businesses such as massage therapists and hairstylists, among others.